As a semi-professional photographer with my own personal photo bucket account, I'm often asked for advice. And the most common question is, Ken, how do I take good photographs of my tires? Well, I'm going to show you. Really important to start with a good, high-quality photo scanner. The way to tell that, of course, is it'll say photo. I mean, duh, right? And this one happens to be a Dell unit. It's worked perfectly for me. Now the trick is, you need to remove the top paper tray because clearly you're not going to be scanning paper, right? You're going to be scanning tires. And uh, that plastic tray just gets in the way. Don't worry, a high quality tire photo scanner has a removable top tray. In fact, professional ones don't even have the top cover at all. This one I've already removed it. And you want to make sure that the glass pane is clean so you get a nice clear image. Don't neglect that. Perfect. Now this process remains more or less the same regardless of what tires you're trying to scan. I'm just starting with these little tiny ones here to give you an idea. But more or less it's the same even all the way up into, you know, what someone would consider uh, a semi-large tire. So first we need to place the scanner in position. It's important that you get it set properly and then pull it back a little bit. So you want to get her in there nice and tight and then remove it just a little. And that's perfect. Wonderful. Now we can begin the scanning process. Yeah. Okay. 